Hi Big Tractor Power fans, this video comes to you from a field located in southwestern Indiana where a 525 engine horsepower Titan STR525 articulated four-wheel drive tractor is working on seedbed preparation with a 50-foot wide Kent Discovator Series 5 soil finisher and Kilbro's D20 crumbler ahead of corn planting. Titan is a tractor brand that you may not have heard of. Only a few of these machines were built. In this video, I would like to share with you the production history, specifications, and original price tag of the Titan STR525 tractor. But first, let's head out to the field so that you can see and hear all this big tillage action. The Titan Tractor brand was created by Jack Johnson, the former president of Steiger Tractors. His company, Power Mart Incorporated, located at 4050 West Main Avenue in Fargo, North Dakota, also home to Steiger Tractors, began remanufacturing and redeveloping high horsepower, high houred articulated four wheel drive tractors in the late 1980s. The company would take a high hour machine with 10,000, 15,000, 20,000 plus hours and rebuild it into a capable modern powerhouse. The company initially planned to produce tractors in the 325, 360, 400, 425, 450, and 525 horsepower ranges. The donor tractors for a Titan machine were completely taken apart and rebuilt. A customer could custom order the high horsepower tractor that they wanted. They were able to choose from Caterpillar, Cummins, and Detroit diesel engines. They were able to choose from a variety of transmission options, including full power shift, automatic, and constant mesh, as well as ordering new axles and drive lines. For their tractor. Titan tractors were created during a very difficult time for farmers. High interest rates, low grain prices, and drought had completely sidelined the agriculture industry in the United States. Labor was also scarce on farms, so farmers needed high horsepower tractors to run wider and faster implements to cover their ground and plant their crops. Unfortunately, because of the agricultural economy, they didn't have the funds to invest in these machines. 
During the 1970s, high-horsepower articulated four-wheel drive tractor manufacturers were ever-expanding their market and increasing horsepower. Manufacturers like Big Bud, Rome, Steiger, and Versatile were always seeking a new level of power. By the 1980s, they were manufacturing tractors from 470 to 525 engine horsepower and looking to increase up to 600 horsepower. Large tractors offering high horsepower come with a big price tag. The machines in the 470 to 525 horsepower range in the early 1980s had a price tag from 170 to nearly $200,000. Four-wheel drive articulated tractor sales completely ground to a halt by the mid-1980s. Manufacturers like Big Bud and Rome exited the marketplace. Steiger was sold to Tenneco, the parent company of Case International, and Versatile was sold to Ford New Holland. As the specialty high-horsepower tractor manufacturers changed direction, so did their product line. The achievement of 600 horsepower soon dropped back to around 330 to 350 horsepower. But farmers were still looking for the big machines, and that's where Jack Johnson thought he could meet that marketplace by remanufacturing the previously built high horsepower tractors. The tractor that you see working in this video is a Titan STR 525. It is a remanufactured Steiger Tiger III ST450. The ST450 was built from 1977 through 1982 by Steiger Tractors in Fargo, North Dakota. The machine is powered by an 18.8 liter Cummins KTA 1150 turbocharged 1,150 cubic inch engine rated at 450 engine horsepower and offering 1,580 foot-pounds of torque. The Tiger III is fitted with a 385-gallon diesel fuel tank. It came from the factory with an Allison CLT 5965 full-power shift transmission with a torque converter with six forward and one reverse speeds. The torque converter automatically locks the transmission of the Tiger III when it reaches 1,700 RPMs. The Tiger III can travel from 1.3 up to 21.6 miles per hour. When it rolled off the assembly line, it weighed in at 43,360 pounds, and it can be field weighted up to 50,000 pounds. The original price tag of a Tiger ST450 Series 3 model when it was new was $176,703. The specifications of the Titan STR 525 tractor and the Steiger ST450 Tiger III remain very similar. There are several upgrades in the Titan. Number one is the horsepower rating from the KTA 1150 engine, jumping to 525 engine horsepower. The tractor's transmission was also changed to an Allison full power shift transmission with 16 forward speeds, which allowed for a better choice in tillage speeds out in the field compared to the six-speed transmission used in the Tiger III. The drop box on the STR525 was changed over from a Tiger III to a Tiger IV. The axles were also changed. Originally, the Tiger III was equipped with Raba axles from the factory, and Titan added Clark axles. With the new axles, the profile of the engine and transmission is raised three inches on the STR525. The Clark axles and the raised height of the tractor allow it to work with a variety of tires. The STR525, working in this video, is fitted with Trailborg Twin 414 800 55.35 tires. The Titan tractor is equipped with an air compressor for air brakes and an air shifter. The Safari Series 3 cab is also updated with improved air conditioning and visibility with a bank of three windows added to the lower portion of the cab. The price tag of a retrofitted Tiger 3 or Tiger 4 Steiger tractor to a Titan STR525 ran right at around $130,000. PowerMart's venture to remanufacture Steiger and Versatile tractors into Titan machines was short-lived. 
It is believed that there were a total of 12 Titan tractors produced. There is at least one STR 360 based on the Steiger Panther 3, and it is understood that there is at least eight STR 525 tractors. In the United States, there are at least three STR 525s. Two are based on Series 3 Tigers, one being in Indiana and the other in Minnesota. There is also a Tiger 4 STR 525 in Illinois. It is thought that at least one STR 525 was delivered in Hawaii for pineapple production and another four shipped to Australia. If you are operating a Titan tractor on your farm, please tell me about it in the comments section below this video. It would be interesting to track down all of the machines built. It is most likely that a versatile tractor was never converted into a Titan, but it would be very exciting to find out if any were. I hope you've enjoyed spending some time out in the field hearing and seeing this Titan STR525 articulated four-wheel drive tractor at work and learning about its brief history in the farm machinery market. I would like to hear in the comment section below if you use an articulated four-wheel drive tractor on your farm or if you have an all-time favorite model or brand. If you've enjoyed this video, consider subscribing to Big Tractor Power YouTube, where there's over 2,000 videos of farm machines in action. If you would like to see additional Big Tractor content from the channel, continue to watch for a few more seconds to the end screen for a direct link to two more Big Tractor Power YouTube videos. As always, thank you for watching.